Hello! Today I'm gonna show you how to do a comic style thing like this. So this is just a short example, but if you want more I posted a one minute video on my other channel using this. So I'm just gonna show one of the effects, but all of them work kind of the same. So let's go! Uh, so I chose to have a white background, so I'm gonna add a white color clip. You could of course have any color. So this is going to be my first track. Um, this is going to be as long as the video, basically. Uh, I'm going to need more tracks, I'm just going to insert some right now. Then I'm going to have another color clip that's going to be as short as the scene I'm going to use this time. And then I'm going to have all of my clips. Okay, so the first thing is I'm gonna put all of them uh, with the transition to the second track. So the white background for just this scene. I'm gonna use a uh, composite and transform. It's a surprise, I know. Uh, on V2. And that's all for now. Same for this one. And I'm just gonna copy and paste. Come on, why are you not pasting? Okay, uh, I guess I'm not gonna copy and paste. On V2. Uh, so right now it doesn't do much, I'm just gonna hide the top layers so that I can just work with this one for now. So I'm gonna want it to be smaller, so with this composite on transform. I'm gonna then change the size, but I also want a different shape, so I'm gonna use rotoscoping. And you know like in comics it's not all squares, sometimes it dif it's different I guess. Um, so I'm gonna make something with a slanted side. Uh, actually I might want this thing in the middle, the circle. <laughs> So I'm just gonna cut it like this for now, try to adjust this, okay, looks good for me, to me, looks good to me, yep. Uh, and then I'm gonna, so t like I said, change the size with this one, I'm gonna put it to uh, maybe like 48% I guess, and at the top right, and more to the left, so that, yep. Then I'm gonna have a second one that's gonna be here, so this one. Again, rotoscoping to make the shape I want. Which is gonna be something like this. Uh, so let's imagine I don't want the center stock, so I'm gonna put it before the... Well, above, above the watermark. This is bad, you shouldn't be doing this, but uh, I mean, it's not like I'm really using it anyway, but you know. I mean, you've seen it now. And um, why did I, yep, okay. And this is good, Ooh, yep. And I'm gonna change the composition transform uh, from here, I'd say maybe 80%, and move it to the right. So yeah, I won't be seeing everything, but you know, that's alright. And higher. And a bit more to the right. Okay. Come on. Okay, this is not bad. I might want to change the rotoscoping a tiny bit, because it's not exactly the right shape, and I went too far here. So I'm just gonna adjust it. It's not too bad. Uh, a bit lower, maybe, so that I can put the whole thing higher. So back to the composite and put it a bit higher. Uh, why? Okay. The last one, this one. Uh, let's show it. Oh my god, this is weird. Um. And this one I might not want rotoscoping because I'm just gonna cut it, so I'm gonna use alpha shapes so that I have a rectangle at the end. 
uh, so 27 reach to 0, then size on x at 500, on y, I don't know, maybe 200 and... wait, 50, 40. So yeah, it comes like 500 in this direction, 500 in this direction, and then, yeah. Uh, uh, let's say I want to keep the middle, and I'm gonna move it with the composite and transform, uh, move it lower. And try to have the same width here and here. So right now I have this, it's good. And now I'm gonna reduce my white background, add a composite and transform here. And then I'm gonna be able to zoom on the different um, pieces of the comic. So maybe 170% to still see that it's a comic, you know? So see the other parts of the track, but not like only see this, you know? So I'm gonna be here first, and then at one point, because uh, in the music or something, I will change to the second uh, part of the comic. I actually want everything to be on smooth, so that it's smooth at the end. So yeah, here I'm gonna move to the right, uh, to the other right. Um, I actually can use this to go maximum here, and actually it's not small enough, so I'm gonna change the zoom to 150 maybe. Uh, yeah, this is not bad. Uh, I'll stay here for a few seconds. And then I will move to the bottom one. And for this one I will want to be at the minimum zoom, because it takes the whole screen. Uh, you could do it differently, of course. Like, you know, it depends on the size of your things. If you have two of them at the bottom, you're gonna want to change. I mean, yeah, it makes sense. And at the end, I'm just gonna add a keyframe to help with the smoothing. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, it looks fucking weird because of the <laughs> clips I've used. Um, but that's good. I just saw a problem with my rotoscoping on this one. Yes, there's a... This keyframe that's not good. I hate how the new rotoscoping works. I'm just gonna move this here. No, that's not gonna work, of course. And I can't move... Okay. Does anybody know a way to remove this fucking keyframe that's wrong? Like, with the other versions you could, but I don't think you can with this one, so I'm gonna have to... I guess redo it. Uh, remove this one and move that... a bit, so that everything lines up. Okay. And maybe more to the right. Yep, like this. That's gonna be better. So, you can see that there's a bit of white on the right and left. I don't really mind it. I think it looks nice. Uh, you could change the keyframes here so that it doesn't happen. So, like, if you go more this way on the keyframe, here, same, don't go, uh, for this one, don't go as much to the right. Um, it should solve these problems. And for this one, maybe don't go as low or something. But like, I think it looks fine like this, but you're allowed to not want the same thing. Anyhow, I hope you like it. Uh, by the way, please tell me if you use any of my effects and stuff uh, in your videos. I love to see it. And uh, I will see you maybe next week. Yeah, I was on a little break for Christmas. I guess you understand. Bye bye.